It may not look like a typical college classroom, but for aquaculture students at the College of Southern Idaho, this is where most of the learning takes place. We have a classroom right inside the building. Um, we'll spend a little bit of time inside learning about the theories and, and the math involved and then get to go outside and actually apply that to the fish and the raceways. We acquired the hatchery in 1976 um, as part of a lease agreement. Um, we've been training students to work in the large Idaho aquaculture industry ever since then. Aquaculture is the breeding, raising, and harvesting of fish. And the aquaculture program at the College of Southern Idaho is virtually one of a kind. So this is the only facility that's really specialized in the farm side of things. You'll have some other facilities where they're more specialized in the research side of fish production um, with little labs, but nothing at a commercial scale like this, this is. And that's important because Idaho is the largest producer of rainbow trout in the nation. We produce about 50 million pounds of rainbow trout every year in Idaho, so having a large commercial rainbow trout facility here where students can learn about the production cycle of rainbow trout is, is great for the area. But that isn't the only species being raised at the hatchery. They also produce tilapia, burbot, and the largest freshwater fish in North America the sturgeon. These giants of the river can live to be over a hundred years old and have been known to be over nine feet long. And while the hatchery produces the other fish for commercial consumption, the goal for the sturgeon program is different. The sturgeon started as a collaborative with Idaho Power, Idaho Fish and Game, and Idaho Aquaculture Association. And the whole goal of that is to make sure sturgeon population numbers in the Snake River stay up and remain high. They don't reach maturity till 10 to 15 years of age. So they're really long-lived species that takes a lot of time and care to raise. Uh, some different things have gone on in our river system and still trying to pinpoint all those different aspects that are, but for some reason they are, they are not reproducing in the wild. So it's important for programs like this to, to help replenish sturgeon population numbers. For students, the aquaculture program is more than just a college degree. It is a path to a job doing what they love. I'm enjoying it for sure, yeah. Fun to learn stuff you want to learn. That's, that's what's cool. It's a lifelong kind of thing, I guess. Mm -hmm. It's like, it's something I've always been doing since I was a kid, so it makes sense.